My registration don't say truck. I'm not in a truck. You're telling me all this other stuff. It's like, come on, man. I'm explaining to you it's not what it's registered as. It's like, do your job, man. Yeah. You think this is $15 now? It's either $5 Wow. All right, I'm going to pay it, right? And for your incompetence, you're going to get some type of repercussion from somebody higher up. Because now I know you don't know what you're talking about if you think I'm supposed to pay $15. You think I'm supposed to pay $15 down across this bridge? I got all my receipts, man. So I, so y'all been messing up that long? Can you get the paperwork for me? And I'll pay the 15 today, because now, now I know that you're wrong. Crazy. That's crazy that y'all think I'm supposed to pay $15. Somebody gonna give me my $10 back, and we're gonna fix it and get it right. And y'all gonna get some good training. Have a good day, man. I ain't gonna waste no more of y'all time, man. This is crazy. So every day I'm gonna have to get harassed by y'all talking about fifteen dollars. Peace, family. The Delaware River Port Authority might owe you some money. They have been probing people lately and asking them for their registration or for you to open your door to show the weight of your vehicle, so that way they could determine how much you should pay for a toll. I got an idea. I want to go weigh my vehicle. We are on my way to the weigh station now. Let's see if this works. And uh, we're going to take it from there. We're going to bury the hatchet. If my vehicle is over the weight, I will accept it fully. And if it is not, then that means make this known because that means other people are actually losing money and being extorted rather because they do not know what their vehicle weight is. What I've learned in my investigation is that the actual vehicle weight for many vehicles is not printed on the vehicle. However, you can determine the vehicle weight with calculations, and that is not being done. What they're doing is they're looking at the maximum payload that the vehicle can uh, operate safely under with this particular vehicle. 8,700 pounds is the GVWR, which is the gross vehicle weight rating, which is not the gross vehicle's weight, which means that is the maximum safe capacity for this vehicle to travel on the road, meaning full tank of gas, 16 passengers, as this can carry, a trailer, fluids, air, tires, what the vehicle is and what it can actually pull is not to exceed 8,700 pounds. So the sticker on the side of the door says GVWR, once again, which is gross vehicle weight rating 8,700 pounds. They are saying that my vehicle weighs 8,700 pounds when that is not the actual vehicle's weight. We want to see how much it weighs. I'm sure that it does not weigh what they say it weighs, and I'm also sure that it is under what the threshold is to pay the additional toll, which is 7,001 pounds. Anything under 7,001 pounds has a toll duty of $5. And I believe this vehicle is definitely under 7,001 pounds. But we want to figure out right now. I'm actually turning into the place now where they have the weigh station. And we're going to check this out. I know that my vehicle is under 7,001 pounds. I did my Google search. I did my due diligence. Everyone that I talked to basically just seems like they're going off of their discretion and not actually a policy or anything solid. Man, we just solved the big case, man. I knew it, bro. I knew it. That's crazy, man. Woo! Case closed. And I want my refund.